we actually we got some good advice in our pre-marriage class that we took uh, and it's really simple it's I mean if there's something we need to talk about everything else is off and the big thing is eye contact um, we don't have serious conversations with the TV on or you know playing with the dog or anything like that it's like we're we're still neither one of us are moving around we're not doing anything else whether it be washing dishes or cooking or whatever it's um, the two of us I mean literally just looking into each other's eyes and I know that when she's looking at me she's listening to me and she I would imagine that she knows the same um, so you just have to I think the key is just being oh I'm can't think of the word that I'm wanting to uh, to use but basically just make sure that you're committed to the conversation and, and nothing else yeah and I think when we're talking about you know how do you know that other person is listening and how do you know that they're really taking you know heart to what you do have to say it's important and I think for Matt and I one thing that we are still practicing but I think it's beneficial is when I come home from work or when he comes home from work usually one of us is going to say something about our work day and yes granted you know pumps or anything that has to do with factory equipment it's probably like not the most exciting thing for me to hear about it's not yeah it's not the most exciting thing for me to talk about yeah but it's his day and he's my husband and i'm the first person he sees when he gets home and so for a wife it's really important to sit down and listen to your husband and let him talk to you um you know for us i feel like we are best friends and so he should be able to come home and say that and I need to stop what I'm doing, and I'm not always the best at it, and look him in the face, look him in the eyes, and listen to what he's saying, and then ask him questions. That, I feel like, shows him that I'm listening. Okay, well, what about that? What happened in your day? Um, and then if there's something that I really wanna tell Matt that's important, and I need to make sure he's listening, I really will, if the TV's on, I'll turn it off, I'll make sure I'll get in front of him and I'll say, hey, I want to talk to you about something. This is really important and I really want you to understand this is important to me. And so usually I know if he kind of stops what he's doing, he looks me in the face like we talked about earlier and, you know, eye contact. Um, it's just about communication and you need to tell your spouse this is important and I hope you're listening. Yeah, because it's, it's very easy to tell when you're talking to somebody whether they're, they're into it or not. And so if... Especially if you're a husband and your wife's talking to you, it'd be a very wise, very wise decision to drop everything else you're doing if it's something serious that she wants, because she'll remember it. Playing on Facebook, uh-huh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that would not be me. It's me. So, <laughs> I'm not a Facebooker. I know. So those are things that we do.